Hey guys, good afternoon. We are back. Um, we're definitely uh, about to jump in and look at this uh, new Tom McDonald song that just released, New World Order. But uh, as you guys have probably seen that come to the channel, I also do RC uh, trucks. Uh, mainly uh, enjoy doing uh, various custom paint jobs on bodies and whatnot. Um, just wanted to give you guys a quick shot of this one I finished up not too long ago. Uh, obviously inspired by the uh, Dax Tom McDonald song Propaganda. Pretty sick, pretty proud of it. Um, this is definitely a shelf shelf body. I won't be uh, won't be beating on this one too much. Um, there you go. Just wanted to give you guys a shot of that. Someone uh, finished up, like I said, not too long ago, and uh, pretty proud of it. So um, let's. Uh, there you go. And now let's get into this. Uh, let's get into this new song. Good afternoon, everybody. It is uh, Friday. We are back. Uh, Tom's got a new song with Adam Calhoun that just dropped. Or I should say a new video that just dropped. Um, man, it's been a while. Uh, I don't. God, I don't think the, the first time we've done a, a video in a minute. Um, like you saw earlier, I mean, you know, I do RC stuff as well, a little here and there on the channel. I got another video I'm throwing together as far as the RC stuff goes. Um, but man, today it's 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 it's. Tom's first song of uh, 2022, and he has brought Adam Calhoun along. Song is called New World Order, so I kind of have an idea of what to expect out of this. So I think we need to go ahead and just get into it. Uh, looking forward to it. I mean, Tom, once he once he starts dropping music, it's usually just right on top of each other. So. Um, I've been gone for a bit, um, work's been crazy, haven't had a whole lot of time to make any kind of content, I think I had a, uh, you know, a video I did a few weeks ago where I was working on one of my, one of my trucks or whatnot, and, uh, it's kind of a long video, that was, uh, probably should have edited that down some, but, um, either way, uh, if you have any interest in the RC world, definitely check out some of the other ones, um, I've got one where we talk about, uh, painting the different RC bodies, and then the last one I did was, a uh, wide kit install on a Traxxas Max, which I think you can see it in the background over here, um, outside of that, let's get into this song, um, ever since Tom started talking about it, I've been, been excited, like I said, first song of 2022, and then Tom started saying, "Hey, I've got this secret, uh, this uh, this other artist that I'm keeping a secret. I'm not not gonna let anybody know." And then he drops the artwork. And we see it's Adam Calhoun, which was <clears throat> probably a surprise to a lot of people. Um, they've had kind of a rocky past. I know, um, you know, there was an interview that Adam Calhoun did where he. Uh, Kind of, I wouldn't say spoke negatively of Tom, but definitely questioned his motivations and some of the content of his music, why he would, you know, make a song about uh, cancer or coronavirus. I mean, there's two songs I've actually uh, done videos for. Um, and he's made, a, you know, a few other remarks or whatever. Apparently they talked. They're cool. Um... You know, Adam Calhoun did a did a live, I believe it was on Instagram, where he said, you know, hey, I talked to Tom. Tom's actually a genuinely good individual, and, you know, apparently they're cool. Um, that's not the first time we've heard someone say that, where they've um, kind of been iffy or had some questions about Tom, and then, uh, you know, spoke with Tom, and, you know, kind of see he's actually a pretty good dude, so... Um, it was a shock, honestly, to see Adam Calhoun's name on here, but knowing his music, his content, um, man, I can't wait. This is going to be awesome. I hope it's going to be awesome. I doubt I'm going to be disappointed, but let's let's get into it. Here we go. New World Order, Tom McDonald, and Adam Calhoun. I notice uh, they didn't put featuring on there. Um, so it's a full-on collab. So let's see. Let's see what we got. 
Here's the problem with America. The country is broken. Cause they minds stay closed, but they mouths stay open. Get attacked okay, and we blame in terrorists. Go broken, we blame the price. Blame races for the racism. But only if his skin is white. If we don't need guns, cause we can call the police. We don't need fire extinguishers. Call a fireman, please. Hmm. You didn't want to build a wall and now the border is weak. Your favorite actor has a gate that's like 15 feet. Racism wow. is gay yeah. if you're a fan. That's something that Tom has touched on before. It's like, you know, it's like you don't want a wall around the country, but you've got a 10, 15 foot wall around your house. Why? Why do you have a wall around your house? What is what? Is, what purpose does that serve? If, you know, we don't need a wall or any kind of like control at our borders for the country. Why do you need to control your property? Order is weak. Your favorite actor has a gate that's like 15 feet. Racism is gay. If you're offended, that's retarded. And tolerance oh, is great wow. until you speak in your... <laughs> Racism is gay. And <laughs> if you're offended, that's retarded. If you want to string... You want to offend some, some soft people, that that is a... That, that, those are some words you can string together just to piss people off. And I that was that was a troll line right there that was fantastic feet racism is gay if you're offended that's retarded and tolerance is great until you speak and you're a target if a white yep. man paints his face black he's a racist piece of garbage but you put him in a dress and he's courageous and he's gorgeous all these double standards man i'm tired of the wow. noise freedom's an illusion if they censor your voice call yep. a dad a deadbeat for neglecting his boys but a mom kills a baby and you call it pro-choice you act like you're so much Call a dad a deadbeat if he neglects his boys, but a mom kills a baby and it's called pro-choice. I mean, is he wrong? Is he wrong? Think about that one. Like, why is it okay for one? Why is one acceptable and the other isn't? One's pretty damn extreme. The other one's just not. I mean, I mean, wow. That... But a mom kills a baby and you call it pro-choice You act like you're so much better than us Yeah, we know that Who told you that you're so special To a new world order Your facts ain't facts without censoring us Yeah, we know that yep. Good job, you lose, here's your medal To a new world order Why they hate the flag, they try to burn it to the ground Don't do that in front of me, I'ma let off a round, pal Scream loud, burn the Hell city yeah. down now. Put it on the news, make them all feel proud. Look, make a system where 85% of black. So he just said, burn the city down, put it on the news, make them all feel proud. There's a lot of people. And man, I had some of these people on my Facebook feed just cheering on the riots that took place over the summer. I mean, we saw people burning down their own neighborhoods, destroying small businesses that probably agreed with what they were rioting over probably shared a similar belief but it didn't matter because they burned down these businesses i saw people who had worked their whole lives to build up uh, a private business and overnight it was destroyed and wh where was the government on that one you had politicians cheering that on agging that on um and they all came from one one side where is the other side was condemning the rioting um man just is deep getting into it don't do that in front of me i'm gonna let off a round pal scream loud burn the city down now put it on the news make them all feel proud look make a system where 85 percent of black people fill the prison is it because they black or they make bad decisions i ain't good at math but it seems like it's division or is it white privilege Man. i believe politicians need to be locked up try to take our freedom stats how you get shot up got our back yep. against the wall try to just stop us more guns more ammunition please stock up Man, that's something that is, you know, the line of politicians need to be locked up. The politicians do shady shit. That is, to me, and I've always thought this, Trump won in 2016 because he was not a politician. Plain and simple. He wasn't. He was voicing concerns about observations that he had made within this, this country. Now, Trump's not a wordsmith. He's terrible to listen to speak because his mind goes all over the place and he tries to touch on you know multiple points at the same time but 100 percent politicians typically i would say 
rough estimate, 80 to 90 percent of them, crooked as hell. Um, there is absolutely no reason why any of these politicians have spent 20, 30 years in office. Hell no. Get these people out of Congress. Get somebody else in there. These people that are in there now are so out of touch. And they're just spitting the same policy over and over and over and over and over. And nothing nothing changes. I mean, things are actually getting worse. But, I mean, nothing really changes. Because you have these same bullshit just being spit out in Congress over and over and over again. Tissues need to be locked up. Try to take our freedoms, that's how you get shot up. Got our back against the wall, try to just stop us. More guns, more ammunition, please stock up. Election gets rigged, rights get infringed. Take this syringe, frighten your kids, mm. show up right where you live. Make me want to grab a rifle and just go. You act like you're so much better than us. Yeah, we know that. Who told you that you so special? To a new world order. Your facts ain't facts without censoring us. Yeah, we know that. Good job, you lose is your medal. To a new world order. And everyone blames white folks for every little bitty thing. We don't have no one to blame. We take responsibility. They mm. tell you be a man, then call it toxic masculinity. Then when you act too feminine, they call it white fragility. I don't understand trans man with humility. I'm just trying to raise my kid the best of my ability. If I disagree, you try to cancel. Get rid of me. You cancer. You can't be the answer. You killing me. And I hate white supremacy just as much as you. But okay, this is cool. So... Normally, when you have two artists do a song, you have one artist do one verse and another artist do another verse, and then whoever the top build artist um, will typically finish out the song, or the featured artist will finish out the song, one or the other. Um, we've seen this before in other other songs where you know another artist is featured. You have your main artist do your first and third verse, and then your featured artist will either do typically does the middle verse, or it'll just be two verses, one and the other. They're actually doing their own individual verses, first and second, and now they're doing this third verse together, so um, kind of going back and forth, which is really cool. Um, it's kind of different. You don't see it too often. So I'm going to back this up a bit, and we're going to start this verse over, and I'm going to shut the hell up for a few minutes. And minutes. everyone blames white folks Link for every this, little yes. bitty thing. We don't have no one to blame. We take responsibility. They tell you be a man, then call it toxic masculinity. Then when you act too feminine, they call it white fragility. I don't understand trans man with humility. I'm just trying to raise my kid the best of my ability. If I disagree, you try to cancel. Get rid of me. You cancer. You can't be the answer. You killing me. And I hate white supremacy just as much as you. But I ain't feeling guilty for something I didn't do. Nope. The system's killing everyone. It sucks, but it's true. They kill you, then they broadcast it. Call it the news. Or they'll brainwash you through social media feeds. And if you disagree, delete you immediately. Make yep. America China pretty easy to Damn. see. I will always remember the land of the free. You act like you're so much better than us. Yeah, we know that. Who told you that you so special? To a new world order. Your facts ain't facts without censoring us. Yeah, we know that. Good job, you lose is your man. Wow, didn't expect that. The Brave, Calhoun McDonald. Pre-order the new album now on iTunes or Amazon. Man, Tom. Tom. You admitted that you lied to us when you said you were taking a break. You have been busting your ass, my friend. You got a whole album coming? And it's going to be on iTunes or Amazon? That's a first. That's a first. Tom, you, t Tom does his albums. He typically doesn't put them on digital platforms. Typically physical only. But we getting a whole album from Calhoun and Tom McDonald? Guys, that's huge. That's huge. So now I want to jump over to iTunes and kind of... Well, not iTunes because I don't fuck with Apple. Um, Amazon and... Uh, See when this thing's supposed to be released, but damn, starting out 22, 2022 strong. Um, 
I mean, Tom definitely went straight in to what he's, I don't want to say what he's known for, but what really got him a lot of attention um, with the controversial political views. I don't see anything controversial about it. Like, I listen to a lot of Tom songs and everyone's like, oh, it's controversial. Well, he's not spitting the same garbage that every other rap artist out there is spitting. Same with, with Calhoun. I mean, he's... The, 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 their lyrics are commentary on the, the, the shit they see. Um, And if they don't agree with it, they're speaking about it. Or they're pointing out the double standards, which they mentioned a few times in this song. Um, So, I mean, I don't... Yeah, sure, that's controversial to some people if you're soft as shit and can't handle a an opposing viewpoint. But for the most part, I mean, people should speak up. They should express their opinions. Um, and especially call out the bullshit when they see it. I mean, 100%. Wow. This was huge. I was expecting a new song. And then they announce, drop this bomb at the end of the video. That's huge. Tom, you got us on that one. You got us on that one. Um, Didn't see that coming. Can't wait for it. That's going to be awesome. Um, Thanks for tuning in. Uh, I do appreciate it as always. Um, Kind of a small channel here. We, We broke 200 subs, which is... I never expected that to happen. Um, so if you enjoyed the video, enjoyed the song, um, enjoyed listening to me run my mouth for a couple minutes, uh, hit the subscribe button, like the video, um, you know, share it with friends or whatever. I mean, I appreciate it. Um, appreciate you guys dropping in and watching. Uh, and, um, definitely, uh, you know, Tom was saying earlier this week, this one, this song's going to get shadow banned. It's going to... It, they're they're going to mess with the algorithm so that it doesn't pop up in people's feeds and whatnot. And I tend to agree with them. So definitely hit Tom's channel. Share this video everywhere. Get it out there. Uh, these guys work hard. And they're, uh, they're saying stuff a lot of people are scared to say. And uh, we got to support that. That's, um, that's one way to affect change. Um But again, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate it. And uh, you guys have a safe... You guys have a safe Friday. Be safe. Stay clear of this damn Rona that's running around. Trust me, it's not fun. Just got over it a couple weeks ago. Um, Take care of yourself. Be healthy and be safe, guys. Y'all have a good one. And um, we'll see you again soon. I got a couple other videos lined up. So um, we'll get some more content up a little quicker. Thanks again. We'll see you guys later.